most famous physical therapist on the internet. All right, folks, I'm Bob Schultz, physical, physical therapist. I'll Brad, get it out. Brad Heineck, physical therapist. Because we're the most famous physical therapist on the internet. In our opinion, of course, Bob. Booyah. Booyah. Okay, today we're going to talk about this one thing is making you look older and you don't even know it. And I'm, we're going to show you how to correct it. You got my attention, Bob. All right, well, we're going to keep you dragging on a little bit here. We're going to keep you mesmerized. Oh, yeah. If you are new to our channel, please take a second to subscribe to us. We provide videos on how to stay healthy, fit, pain-free. We upload every day. Also, you're going to want to join us on our social media channels because we are always giving away something. I think we're giving away a stretch-out strap again. Okay. And uh, th that's really a cool device using you can use to stretch out the whole body. If you if you don't want to join us on Facebook, you can go down to our website, Bob and Brad, and there go to our go. giveaways. And that'll be doing our weekly giveaway on there. That's right. All right, Bob. Let's carry on. I want so to know what's going on. I have to first apologize because we did a video the other day, and it was like a 60-second test to determine what your cardiac uh, status is. You're going to have a heart attack. Yeah, huh? right. And um, I was doing push-ups on there, and... <laughs> Brad didn't tell me. I mean, you were kind of hinted towards it. I said, him. get your head up, Bob. Yeah, yeah. And it's like, well, whatever. He's so on his own. I had, in my mind, I had the most perfect form. <laughs> I seriously did. I thought I was straight like a rod, you know, like a straight rod. Yeah. And then I watched the video. like, oh, my God. I looked right. awful. I was bent over. And we did get some comments on that. I, we, you know, first off, I don't mind comments criticizing me at all. But please keep it civil out there. Don't start yelling at each other at um I mean, you were absolutely right. It was a bad form, <laughs> and we need to have it pointed uh, out. Yeah. So anyway, what happens, you know, over time and in life, you start, your posture starts getting bad, mm -hmm. and you don't know it and because that becomes your new normal. Um, if you sit for a long time and you sit like this, it feels, yeah, it feels weird to straighten up. You think you're looking really, you know, unusual to straighten up, and when, in fact, this feels like you're, you are straight. Right. I remember a friend of mine, he was... He worked uh, for Honeywell, oh. and he they, they saw him. He saw himself on the security tapes one time, and he's like, he honestly said, "Who's that old man walking?" And it was him, because <laughs> I mean, he didn't realize his posture had gotten so bad. So uh, if you you know the one thing that's going to make you look older is bad posture. I mean, I you, you could tell somebody walking along, and they're like this. You think you're going to add ten years to their life? Yeah, I mean, right. But if they're walking along like this, yeah, kind of bounding a little there bit. There you go. Yeah. So, especially nowadays with computers, uh, cell phones, all promote and actually kind of accentuate that as well. Well, so. Brad, I think you'll agree with this that since we started doing videos, yeah. our posture has gotten better because our earlier videos, we'd we'd watch them like, oh my God, I yeah. thought I had good posture. In it. Yeah. So yeah. you know, and it's like, what are you gonna do, Bob? Yeah. Would you really gotta watch these videos and then? Yeah, we're going to show you how to correct your posture now. I mean, after all this, uh, so we're gonna, these are some of the things you can try. Brad, you're going to first show wall angels. Wall angels. Yeah, and this is a great one. You can do it because you don't need any equipment. You just need a wall. Yes. So you're going to go up against the wall. I like to put my sacrum or my butt right up against the wall there, my shoulders, and then get your shoulders back. And if if you're able to get your head to touch, hopefully you don't have head forward posture so, so tight that you can't do that but that's okay if you do we got a video coming up on that you can one, work too. your way back if, yep. you, if, if, yep. you, if you don't make the wall so if you can get flattened out then you're going to go back like this elbows and hands to the wall and right now i can feel things are stretching right i'm working at this so and I, you may not be able to get to that point even right you yeah. may want to start down here and here and and work it out because as you go out like this that opens it up and i can feel it getting the rust out up and, um, and as you go up, your hands might pull away. Yeah. Even. So um, you got to again, you know, work your way closer right. and closer so over time. You do the best you can. And boy, I, I've only did that three or four repetitions, and I can just feel yeah. things. And you can up. walk away from the wall, feeling confident that you're straight. Right. Now we're going to show you. I'm going to show you one with the booyah stick. This is one more for learning how to have good straight posture when you're doing movement, right. and you're lifting things like that. So that's, that's mine. Oh my gosh, how there you possessive go. can you be? So anyway, I'm gonna take the stick and you're gonna go ahead and you can do this with any stick, broom stick, but this is nice length because you need all five feet on this one. Right, yeah. So as you can see, I got contact on my sacrum again or my pelvis. I got it on my mid back and on my head. Mm. And this is really difficult to do without this. I mean, if you try to say, line up, 
you just don't line up right. I mean, every time I put the stick up there, I'm, I'm surprised how far off I am. This guarantees that you've got yeah. right where you need it. So there. then in addition to this, you're going to actually stretch the arm up. Yeah. Because you want to get length in the back. That, you know, he was telling me this before. I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It looks like something kind of good. Yeah. I did it. It really helps. So it's, now you're just going to work deal. on doing squats and bending forward like this. And this actually is going to work on training your back to be in the lengthened and correct position when you are moving. Now, you do have to switch, too. You have to go with the other arm, right. too. Uh, Otherwise, you're going to be unbalanced right one arm one arm will get longer than the other and we don't yeah. need that so again so i'm stretching the back now when you do this after you've done like a set of 10 uh, what you're going to find mm -hmm. out is again that same feeling like you're going to feel like the back is lengthened you're like you're in good posture my back always feels great after i do this not only that you're going to get some nice workout with your legs and hips those quadriceps are working that's right and there's some variations we can do of that we're going to do that in a future video but right now that i just want to kind of give you a little teaser sure so the third thing you can do is you actually do what happened to me. You, you, do, you know, you have somebody videotape you or take a photograph or um, someone just cue you. Right. If a good friend would cue you and tell you. I tried, Bob. <laughs> I, I said, get the head up. And you, I could tell it was. It you, was bad. You were on a roll and I couldn't. I, I just didn't know what to do. You know, the first time I've experienced this is actually I was a student in physical therapy school. <laughs> and we had to look at each other's posture yeah. and, and evaluate it. So I get up there and they're going, well, he's got forehead, head, rounded. I'm like, I said, seriously, I thought, what are they talking about? I thought they were, my knees were back. And I go, are they joking? Yeah. And they said, no. And, and I, I didn't realize I had terrible posture. Yeah. And, and, you know, then I started correcting it at that yeah. point. So, yeah. So, you know, big thing is if you got kids, start them out right away. Keep them seated up tall at the, at the supper table. That's right. Wrap them on the knuckles like the old nuns. Oh, Bob. Why, oh, I guess Bob? that's right. This is a family show and it's not violent. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, everybody, for watching. <laughs>